Hello, I'm at the Britain Archive looking at some wonderful songs by Britain. They have accompanied me all my life, all my singing life from the age of 15. And here they are, the Charm of Lullabies, um, from a collection of poems Britain found in this wonderful book of lullabies. He chose five songs initially um, and published five. But I was in this wonderful library not long ago and I found two songs that he hadn't um, had published and edited and I asked Colin Matthews if he would make them into, um, as best he could, into um, published songs for all of us mezzos to sing. And they were in a pretty complete form, actually. The Sweet Lullaby is by Nicholas Breton and it was a very famous poem in his day, um, published in all sorts of different anthologies of the time. And it's the story of um, a mother who unfortunately has become pregnant by a, a rich nobleman. And he, of course, has deserted her, run off, uh, left her with the baby, and she's worried that the baby will grow up with the shame um, of that unfortunate uh, liaison uh, but it's it's it is the most beautiful wistful lullaby um, the other song somnus Humble God is, is uh, again, a famous poem by John Denham. It's got a, a, a lovely rising line, often like, um, almost like breathing in sleep. So you breathe the intake and then coming down again. And it's, it's, it just sort of goes in waves, this song. Um, and likening sleep to death. You know, I'll just read you the line. Sleep that is thy best repast Yet of death it bears the taste, and both are the same thing at last. So here, here we are doing something every day, we sleep every day, and yet it could be our last, um, our last day. Colin Matthews has requested that we don't, as singers, tag them on to the end of Charm of Lullabies as a sort of afterthought. So I'm, when I do schedule them in a recital, I'll pop them somewhere else in the programme, slightly apart from the others. So um, I, th I think it's important that they are recognised that they weren't sanctioned by Britain to be um, edited, but I think they really ought to be sung. So, so these are these wonderful seven songs um, from A Charm of Lullabies.